All right, guys, we're going to put some rounds through the ROM RG10. Uh, I got six rounds of 22 short loaded up, and uh, we're going to see what it does. Uh, just a side note, uh, like I say, this is a, your classic Saturday night special. I believe uh, it was a gun like this, the Big Brother, the RG14 and 22 long rifle that John Hinckley used to try to assassinate President Reagan. So, yeah, it is what it is. So. We're gonna go down here and put a few rounds through it, and I'm gonna start out single. It is single and double action, but I'm gonna try. That double action pull feels like about 20 pounds, so I'm gonna start in single action and see what happens. So let's put a few rounds. Let's see if we can hit the target. I got Joshua being my cameraman today. You got me in the frame. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. I'll try to shoot the black square there. I'm gonna go one hand. All right, we hit it. Try that center silk, white plate. Miss. If it's hitting high or low, we'll see. I think it's shooting high. Let me go a little bit lower. Oh, misfire. Misfire. And misfire. Okay. Well, that's about what I expected from some of the videos I've watched. Uh, let's see what we got here. Yeah. I was watching some videos on YouTube last night, and uh, seems like they would pull it like four or five times, and then it would go off. Let's try double action. Nothing. give it the old college try anyways but uh yeah about what I expected let me take a few of these out these spent ones out and we'll try to we'll try and yeah it doesn't have an ejector rod and I forgot to bring me a nail so all right I got three in there it looks like maybe just light primer strikes is why it's not going off could be a wore out hammer there's no telling let's try one more let's try the single action again Shooting very high. Okay, it appeared the cylinder didn't rotate that time, so. All right, that's six. We hit the target two out of six, so uh, yeah. I mean, it's about what you expect. It may just be a wear out hammer, but man, that trigger is awful. Definitely wouldn't depend on this gun uh, to save my life and but, you know, it didn't it didn't explode. I didn't get any debris back in my face like they said in some of the videos, so I don't know. I can't say I recommend it, but it's a neat little it's a neat little thing. So um, well, I appreciate you watching guys. Y'all have a good one.